Ah, crank. Uh, duh. Oh, this is gonna be like some nun shit. Oh no. I've seen this. This is the nun. Or is it Conjuring 2? Whichever. Oh no. I can't move. <laughs> he was a fireman, bold and true. Until one night, the flames withdrew. Bars? Oh my god! A mother and a son lost to the blaze. Their lives cut short in a fiery haze. The father saw the firemen arrive, but ran in first, too fearful of time. Look at these images. Through smoke and flame, he couldn't stay. The firemen pulled him and rushed him away. Oh, but left the... Oh no, the father passed, his family gone, and the firemen's guilt would linger on. He left the job, tried to stand tall, but the silence... Why did it go so slow? Broke with a sudden phone call. Oh, here we go. We got the story starting. All right. Oh, nice. Okay. Picked up the phone. Who is it? You. Hey, who's this? Hey, it's your brother. Jason. What's up, dude? What's up, Jason? Like Kelsey? What's up? Hey, Jason. Long time no see. How you been? Yeah. It's been a while. I've been busy. Hmm, okay. What's going on with you? Yeah, I noticed. Haven't heard from you in months. What's going on? Look, I don't really have time for small talk right now. I okay, my bad, dude. Oh, my bad, brother. I just thought you kind of wanted to talk to your family. Don't worry about it. Oh, okay. What's up? I'm moving out, and I need some help. Thought maybe my dear brother could spare a few hours. Hmm. No. <laughs> moving out? You could have given me some heads up. Why now? All of a sudden. Life happens, all right? Look, I don't Are need to explain beefing? myself to you. Can you help or not? You don't need to explain your- Bro, what the fuck? Well, I guess I can help, but no, fuck him. I'll meet you outside in five minutes. Uh, Alright. No! You're a dick. Oh, oh, the sensitivity is crazy. Hold. Oh, it can turn it down just right here. Uh, how do I do it? Nothing special. Okay. Going no, no, no. Okay. Just the same old routine, I guess. All right. Jason, you're a rude guy. You know that? You're just not a nice person. How am I doing this? Uh, siren heads of- Siren heads ahead. What was Probably that? It was- the church bell or something. Uh, no, it's si siren heads in the fog. Anyway, are you that... still looking for a new job? Jason, do we have a problem? I wanted to make a difference, to be the one who saved lives. Oh, I'm the fireman. Oh, okay. But when you fail to save someone, it breaks you. <gasps> Cow! It's a moo moo. And no one tells you how to carry that weight. Look at the coo- the coos, the cows. Look at the moos. Uh, wait. That's not a church bell. Uh, what- what is it then? It's nearby. Pull over where that noise is coming from. Jason, pull the fuck over. Uh, uh, is this normal in our community, Jason? Jason? Uh, is this standard in our community? Because, uh, it's not where I'm from. Uh, uh, Jason? Jason? We're at Rose's End. I've been here before. Well, it looks like it burnt down, so... The house burnt down, and I was there to save the family that was trapped inside. Oh, so this is just conveniently the story we're telling? Or that the beginning we're telling? But I didn't make it in in time. The sound is coming from inside the house. How do you know that? It sounded pretty everywhere. We should check it out. Yeah, sure. Jason, let's I go. Guess. Let's get out, strong chin. We got some stuff to do. Can I get out? Oh, there we go. Exit the car. Yes. Okay, can I have sensitivity? Please. Please? Please. Please for the love of God! 
Rose's end. I'm sure that you can change it. I just, I'm dumb. So. All right, Jason. This is how we walk, huh? Enter the house. No hesitation, Jason. I'm going in. Well, no flashlight, huh? We're just gonna stand in the darkness. Uh, there's a basement right there, Jason. Be careful, Jason. There's a paper? Let me read it. Let me see here. Read note. We remember the symbol. A pyramid with a, a bench across it. A line. What does this symbol mean, Jason? Thanks, bud. You're very helpful. Oh my fucking god! Oh my god! Oh, this is intense! My God! <laughs> Brother, let's enter enter that burned building, and then we entered another dimension by mistake. Ignited entry. Okay. Created by Jordan Lindgren. Lind Lindgren. I can't say that. I know he's made bangers like Shopping List. I'm gonna have to look at the other. One. I played another one. I can't remember the name right now, but he makes he just makes bangers for free. He absolutely deserves more credit than he gets. However much credit he gets, it still deserves more. These games are always long, and they're they're good. Well thought out. There's that one where the... Is that a detective? I can't remember. We went to the trailer park, and like, yeah. Did Jason just mug me? Did I just get robbed? What the hell? Is this a house in a cave? Oh no. Oh no. A symbol has been cut into our flesh. Did Jason... slice that into our flesh? Do I keep saying Jason and that's not his name? I feel like it's Jason. Or am I Jason? I don't know. A searing pain, and then I see it carved into my flesh. The symbol of my fate. This mark binds me to a destiny I cannot escape. Jordan, are you a rapper? You write poems, maybe? They're good. You should you should probably take up a, a little career there. Door is locked. Find Jason. Okay, so it is Jason. It's Jason. Hey. All right, door is locked. What is this place? I don't know. But, uh, what the hell is that? Is that the screaming man? Kind of? Just like cropped? No, it's a little different, huh? Oh, it's actually kind of a cool painting. I can't lie, like that's actually kind of dope. All right, Jason! Uh, the door's covered in blood. Uh, hello? Jason. Oh my god. Let's turn this off. Okay, just kidding, I can't. Let's go in here. Reception. Hey, dude, how you... Rope needed uh, to descend into this hole? I don't want to. If anything, I want to go up. There's a rope right here. So, can I enter this? This. What are you talking about? Reception. Okay. Okay, okay my sensitivity is insane. All right, let's... uh. Rope needed. I'm no expert, but I think... Okay, there we go. Attach rope. Interact. Uh, enter the hole. Yes. That's to descend. You got it, partner. It's eternal darkness. Okay, okay. Ooh, a perfectly square cave. Hold shift to sprint. I'm on it. I'm on it? Do I need to sprint? Something... Ha How is a reception down here again? This is this weird business. Uh, what happens if I go this way? Nothing. Okay. Bring. Jason. You got a new job here, Jason. Hello. Ah! Hey! 
love and welcome to First off, my name's Steve, and I will be your personal AI assistant for today. No, you will not. Before we begin, an identification scan will be needed to identify the cause of your death. Death? Please stand still. Death? Uh... Uh... Most sir. The cause of your death is blank in my database. Okay. Which means you are still alive. Oh, thank you, Steve. Can That's good to hear. Can you recall what brought you here? Why are you yelling at me? A hatch in the ground brought me and my brother into this place. His words need to go away. It's kind of hard to read those ones in the middle. The hatch was in previously burnt down house. There's another fellow who goes by the name Brother Jason. Who checked in a few minutes ago. He goes by Brother Jason. You two have matching DNA. Thank you, Steve. Which means that Brother Jason is your brother. Who is named Jason. <laughs> The hatch also means that an entity in this has invited you or your brother here for an unknown reason. Okay. The hatch is unable to separate invitations between shared DNA of siblings. Oh, all right. why the two of you are here. That explains everything. Thank you for clearing that up. But only one is meant to be here, he says. Okay. Uh, what now? Yeah, no, it's perfectly normal that we... Since I can't design into an aftergrave without a valid death permit, I will release you to freely roam the... Until the ones who brought you here decide to send you back. But uh, before you go, I'm required to fly you with the fast package. This is used to relive all the memories by pairing it with a memory orb in order to counteract insanity. I would advise you to stick to your own memory orbs. Unless you like peeking into other people's memories. Okay. Uh, thanks. Anyways, you will now be transferred to... Okay. While Steve seems like a wonderful guy, that was weird. <laughs> Location, visitor glide. I mean, so far, the game just started. And this is Hello. crazy. Welcome on the visitor glide. You are currently being transported to the aftergrave of your inviter. All right. You will arrive shortly. My inviter? Why is the reception thing still there? I think my guy just needs to talk again? Something? Wait. A welcome, a welcome gift, gift has been sent from your inviter. The teleportation of your gift will commence in approximately three seconds. Okay. Uh. Why, thank you. Let's watch the tape. Reception, question mark. VHS tape needed. Yes, yes. Right there. Insert VHS tape. Can I crouch? Watch it a little bit easier? We don't have DVDs here, huh? Or streaming service? In a horrifying incident that has shocked the community, a house fire has resulted in the loss of three lives as it appears to be a sacrificial ritual. The victims have been identified as and her 12-year-old son. Oh my god. The father also lost his life in the hospital a few days later from lung damage and a heroic attempt to rescue his family upon discovery. Okay. It was a cult ritual sacrifice? Is that what they said? I remember these names. I need the reception to go away. <laughs> okay, we can go outside now. Uh, right here? Yeah, 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 yeah. This is cool. Just like a whole, the whole everything about this is fucking awesome. What's up? Jason, you're really making it difficult to find you. This is a nice room. Chase Emily after grave. That's the location. Okay. Find Jason. Check computer. Password needed. Emily Turner123. I got it. I cracked the code. It's not it. Um... Okay, so we need to find a password, presumably. Two beds pushed together, huh? You guys were having fun? Um, anything here? Or can I just leave the room? I can leave the room. Okay. Hey, can I open? There's no drawers there. Uh, wardrobe. Can I open a wardrobe? These important- Oh, what does the memory glasses do? Hold on. Connect these glasses with- Oh, you need a memory orb. Right. 
right, right, right. Let's holster those. Key needed. Okay, so maybe in here. Enter room. Okay. Oh, memory orb. Okay, that's what he was talking about. Hold on, let me take a looky. Anything? Okay. Uh, memory glass needed. Yes. Uh, use memory glass for uses left. Emily's eyes. So we're gonna see key things that maybe Emily does. Am I playing as her? I can look around, Again? but our dryer is too small for this guest room load. Okay. Cellular. Hey, babe. Quick question. Did you happen to change the, the computer voice password? acting is incredible? Oh, yeah, I did actually. I meant to tell you, but it completely slipped my mind. No worries. It happens to the best of us. Why the change, though? Well, our little tech whiz of a son has been spending more time on the computer than on his schoolwork lately. So I thought a little password change might redirect his attention. Ah, sneaky move. So where's the new hiding spot for the password this time? Yes, tell Behind me. Behind the dryer in the utility room. <laughs> Figured it would be a safe bet. Got it. Thanks for keeping things in check, darling. <laughs> okay, Even behind the dryer. Troublemaker, right? exactly. Your little troublemaker is he's discovered Key Hub. <laughs> Death Registry. Emily Turner. Right. This whole family's dead. 1975 to 2013. Oh my god. Burned alive. Oh my god. They already told us that, but that's just a rough sentence to look at for anyone. Behind the dryer. Correct. Is this. Wait, hold on. They look identical. Your washer and dryer are the same thing. Okay. Why couldn't you just, like, remember it? Password, Chase Turner 33. I was actually kind of close. <laughs> like, I was almost there. Uh, hello? Enter room? All right. I'm going. Something's going to happen right now before I get there, I feel like. No? Or is this just pretty straight? What was it? Chase Turner 33? I feel like it was Chase Turner. There was someone under the bed, was it there? Get out from there! Get out! Someone slid under the bed, huh? Or was I seeing things? Okay. Shit. Hello? Hi. Chase? Nope. Turner. 33. Right? Yes. At least make it something a little bit... Okay. Documents. The folder is locked. To open the folder, a few security questions need to be answered. Okay. Does Emily work as a teacher? Yes. Is Chase allergic to peanuts? Yes. Does William enjoy fishing on weekends? Yes. One of those isn't yes. Is Emily's favorite color blue? No. Does Chase have a pet turtle? Yes. Does William enjoy cooking? No. Do you ever feel like you're being watched? Now I do. Yeah, no, now I, yeah, now I do, yeah. Is Emily's favorite flower roses? Um, I'm gonna go with yes. Do you know you're being watched? I didn't until you just said that. So before it was, do you feel like you're being watched? Now I know I'm being watched. So, uh, yes, I do. Yeah. Yeah. Do you recognize the person behind you? Oh my god. Oh my god. Identity verified. Reminder text. Under the- I see- I, I knew it! Under the bed, under the bed, under the bed, under, under the bed, under the bed! Okay. Um, can I leave now? I want to leave now. Yeah! Hello? Under the bed. Check under the bed. Don't do it slowly. Don't do it slowly. Grab key. I thought something was gonna happen. That would have been cool to like reach in there with your hand. And then something grabbed you. But this game is not, it's not like that, I don't think. I don't think it's like the, we're gonna, it's like a dark story. I don't know if like, wait, what was the key for? Key. This key was not here before. Wait, wasn't there a locked door right over here? Locked door. Ah! Wardrobe. I lied. It's it's kind of scary. It's not purely dark storyline. What is that? Oh, I lifted my mouse. Sir? 
Uh, I think he's here now. You think who's here now? Are you sure it's him? Why are you guys so violent going through a door? I saw the symbol on his arm. It's him. Really? They don't like me or what? You mean a child and a mother knocked a door off of its hinges just because they felt like it? Go, 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 go. Key needed. Yep. No, no, I got you. Don't worry. Unlock door. Enter room. The robot saw Chase's tears and pain and gave him an arcade to ease his strain. Play, little one, it softly said. Let joy in games soothe your dread. Ah! Location. Darkness. Chase's zone. Alright. Go ahead. Go through this sad staircase. Why is it so gray? I can't like this. How is this free? Dude, you're... Jordan, you're a legend. Jordy? Jordan? It's Jordy boy, isn't it? Is that the... That's your dev name? On, on itch? I think so. Fucking master, dude. What the hell are you doing, Jason? Stop following me. Do we have beef or what? Is that an elevator? Elevator? No, just go hit the... I'm gonna stop it. Hold on. Call elevator. Yeah, hold on. You're coming back down, whether you like it or not. Okay. What? Find a way to power the elevator. Breaker key needed. Oh, there's a... Okay. Oh, God. The door opened. Okay. I, I, that just sent panic through me. Okay. The way that the lights just kicked off like that? Hear the breathing? Enter room. Okay, so it needed to find a, a way... Oh, the breaker key. Right, breaker key. Um, oh, that's confusing. I felt like I, I didn't know which way to go there for a second. Okay, breaker key. Hopefully this is it. Breaker key. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Breaker key. Uh, fuses needed. Okay, so we have to go further down. Do I not have a flashlight? I don't know. It's kind of look... It looks dark, but then as you advance forward, it's not. By design, right? But it's odd. It's a room. What in the... Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle sewer? Okay, all right. This is a cool feature right here. I like this. This is nice. I like this... This, this area here. Chase's eyes. Chase is the kid. Correct? Yeah. If we win this game with Pong, we should have enough tokens for the main prize. All right. Who's going first? <laughs> I'll take care of this one. Nice. We playing Pong? We're not playing Pong, are we? Oh, God. Like, we already know that, but it's such a rough sentence to see. It's crazy. Activate. Am I playing Pong? No way. I don't even, is Pong the one it bounces back and forth, right? Player one versus Chase. Oh! Oh, that's kind of crazy. Wait, which one's me? Hold on, I can't move. Oh, there we go, it's arrows. I was doing W and, uh, w and S and it wasn't working. Okay. Chase, you're absolutely gonna beat me. Oh my god, left side of the thing. I got you, Pong. I got you, Chase. You're my bitch. Oh, no. Hell yeah. What did he say the score was to get to? I don't remember. To think this was elite gaming at one point in time. Oh, no. Once it gets speeded up like that, that's that's rough. That's tough right there. This is like when you have to beat him is when it's... There you go, there you go. Got you, boy. Grab those fuse. Oh, okay! Hi. Uh, how are you? Uh, Chase, get back here. Chase? Okay. Uh, hello? Alright, we now have the fuses for the ele- Why was- Why was Jason able to go up the elevator so simply? 
And I have to get a fuse and a key and, and everything else, huh? Why? That. Place. Is this that one ride at the, what was it originally? The ride at Disneyland, the, the tower. Tower of Terror? It's something else now, but. Hall Elevator. There we go. Why is that like that? What's going on in there? Let me ha no, I'm not leaving, bye. No. Oh no. Oh no. No. Okay. You're very strong, Emily. You're very strong. Uh, burp. You're strong. I can't, I can't move. I can't do anything other than look around. I don't like it. Stop. Stop it. There's a jack in the box or something coming. Oh no. No, please no. No. Let me go. I can't do anything. <laughs> Elevator's really fast. All right. Oh. <clears throat> Jason? What is this? This is a nice house. That's nice. Right? Uh, interact. Ring the bell. Ring a ding ding. Wait, is this not the. Oh, good! You should have seen the look on your face, you absolute pussy. Yo! Anyways, I have been sent over to inform you that an individual from another afternoon has requested a visitor call with your name on it. <laughs> Isn't that exciting? Yeah, I'm thrilled. I have sparked a phone for you to use. A bit further into the rooms. Too sharp, Percy. We don't get our shot out of phone time between visitors and the dead. So make it quick. Ta ta! <laughs> Is he like an image taken of Mark Zuckerberg's Indeed? And then they blurred it? Like, why does he be so... I, need, I just know, he reminds me of Marky Boy. Interact, here we go. Respond to visitor call. I guess so. All right, I wish that I did not do that. Hey. Hey. You don't know me that well, but I know you. That's cool, man. I'm not allowed to speak to the visitor phone for too long, so listen very closely. Uh-huh. You need to keep moving forward. Eventually, you will find the aftergrave exit. Pass through it, and you will be safe from them. From there, I've arranged the visitor wife to come pick you up and take you to my location. Them. You have to talk. Good luck. Uh, question mark, question mark, question mark. Who's them? Door's blocked. Match. Jason's matches. Okay, what does this do for me? Does this burn the things? When ignited, these matches have the ability to dissolve anything bearing the symbol. Okay, so yeah. Okay. Okay. I would like to... Okay. Let's just pull those out then. Let's just, uh... Let's just get these ready. Ignite. Ignite blockage. There you go. And now, can I... Enter room. Okay. Oh, no. Hold on, let's read this. Hi, Mom. I hear you singing in your room. I tried to open the door, but I don't know where the key is. When you're done singing, can you come to my room and play Pong with me? Chase. Aww. Oh, no. What is... My burn thing. I grab... What did that... What does that do for me? A piece... When joined with a... A piece bearing a symbol. When joined with others, it hints at a hidden purpose. Okay, so I should be on the lookout for these. Is something in here going to chase me? I feel like there is. Okay.
Okay. Uh, this is wild. Okay, get this one. Well, this is helpful. Uh, why would I blow it out? How do I? Hold on. Oh, the the frames there. That's where we put the the shitters. This is where we put the things, right? I could be wrong. No, that's that's where it goes. Yeah, yeah. Maybe not in that order, but that's where they go. Okay. Can be ignited. Yeah, I know. Ignite. There we go. Okay, there's another one. Oh, I see what's happening. Okay, I see what's happening. Hold on, hold on. Grab piece. Okay, 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 okay. So let's put this. Hold on. I still need to find the other one. But grab piece. It goes like this. It goes like this. Oh, I have the other one. I didn't realize I grabbed the other one. Okay. Uh, you go here. Pop. And then you go here. Yeah. There we go. So it looks like that. Yeah, yeah. No. Who fire? Uh. Okay. I'm leaving. Key needed. Is a key gonna spawn or something? Oh, can be ignited. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah. Give me the key. Grab key, and then we get the key going, and then unlock, enter. Oh, darkness. Oh, darkness. Okay. What is this? Interact. Exit? What? Whatever this means. Oh, it says exit. It has to do something with the diary. Yes. I need to find the key to this. Okay, diary key needed. We're gonna have to do one of those memory things. Uh... That's interesting. How do you guys dine up there? Okay, enter room. Oh, no. Oh! This is- what is this, a well? Inspect well. The crank for the well is missing. Okay. But the key could be down there. Okay, so it is, but I need to find the crank. And that's gonna be in another room. It happens to be a trapdoor to darkness. Great. Will you enter the hatch? Yes, I will. Let me in. Oh, descend. Oh, no. No. Oh, no. Okay. Hi, everyone. It's dark. Uh... Hi hey everyone, I'm Johnny Knoxville. Welcome to darkness. The door has been locked behind you. Great. That's what I like to... That's what I like to hear. What is this? Why is that the most interesting thing to me? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I don't... what? Oh no! Okay, so it's like a... it's a maze. In a way. It's in a way, it's a maze. Okay, we just gotta... I think I hear footsteps that are not mine. I might be wrong. The door right here. It's not a door, it's just a blocked thing. Okay, what am I looking for exactly? What do I have? Okay. Okay, this looks pretty promising. What is this? Ah, crank. Uh, duh. Oh, this is gonna be like some nun shit. Oh no. I've seen this. This is the nun. Or is it Conjuring 2? Whichever. Oh no. I can't move. <laughs> Use matches to see in the dark. <clears throat> oh, it's actually dark now. 
Oh no. This game is amazing. What is, oh, check map. Okay, you, backup exit. Backup exit generator. Okay, so I get out, hang a quick right, take that first door on the left, left, left. Okay, 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 I think, I think I got it to the, to an extent. So a quick right and then left, and then the door's right there. We gotta hang a left, and then we gotta hang another left, and then right here, Yes, activate generator. Gas pump. I need to activate the gas pumps before I can power the generator. Of course you do. Where are the gas pumps? Right here. Oh, they're marked. Thank you. But something's gonna happen, right? Keep matches hidden to avoid being seen by her. What? Shut the, shut the fuck up. Shut up right now. I don't know where she is. This is so scary. Hold on. Let me get out of range of that so I can hear. No. She's literally right next to me. Please, God. Please, somebody help me. She's right here. Okay, she's farther now. Okay, she's definitely out of the room, at least. Okay, hang it right. Okay. Activate. Okay, I need to get away from that so I can hear. Okay, 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 okay. I got it, I got it, I got it. Stop sprinting, stop sprinting. We're gonna get ourselves in a situation. Hold on, keep going, keep going, keep going. Activate generator. Okay, I can't hear anything. She's right there. Hold on, hold on. Oh my god. She's right there. Okay. I thought she was going the other way. I thought my via the footsteps she was going the other way. Yeah, okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Just keep it out. I can see. Okay, can be ignited. Ignite. Oh my god. That's horrifying. That is a crazy mechanic. Okay, use the crank. Was that in here? Yes. Okay. Uh, crank. Catch crank. Wind crank. And then this is gonna have a key. Check the bucket. Key. Yes. Uh, Emily's di- Okay, for the diary. That's right, that's right. The hidden key blocks Emily's personal diary. <clears throat> okay. We're on it. I am on the case. Oh, God. Bro, like, thank you for having these be free, but you need to get paid for these, dude. Diary key needed. I understand donations, but I'm saying, like, these are very well-made games. Alright, got the books. Page one. Page one of the diary. We're gonna, like, live the diary? I guess I'll get into the stone bath. Oh, it's like a minecart. Oh! Looks like there actually is an alive. Oh, cool. It may be just... isn't what I expected it to be. 
Me and Chase have been assigned to this thing called an aftergrain. What's up, Steve? I've understood, it's an extension of the place you were at when you died. Hmm. We That's. Our home, so that, the house, at least. that could be a terrible thing, depending on where you die. Okay without me and Chase. I miss him so much. Oh, this is cool. We're just going through the different pages. Oh. It's gonna get dark, though, huh? Like, not dark. It's already dark, but it's gonna get, like, scary. The burn scars still haven't gone away. I don't recognize my little boy's beautiful face. And he doesn't recognize mine either. I could still see the skin peeling from his flesh. Oh my god, there's a person on the track. Steve, move. But that's okay. Oh no, it's the dad. I, just hope I haven't seen the dad, right? And recognize me as his or was that Jason? I don't know. Are these books above us? They are, right? Yeah. The receptionist showed you the way to invite people into my Is that a gun? By using their DNA. I don't know the name of the man who was it, but he left his matchbox in the house after he killed us. No. I think I found it in our aftergrave. No, I am not going to be... No, 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 no. I didn't kill this family, right? Or is it going to be my brother? If you've far enough to find the key to my diary, then you're probably the person I'm writing this to. Emily? I don't know your name. I don't know why you did what you did. But I do remember that symbol. It's going to be... It's the only thing that I saw. Jason's the one, and I'm going to be it's like... It's the only thing I won't forget. That's going to be even further of a twist, because why else is he here? Memory glass needed. Let's go in. Jason's eyes. See, I knew it. I knew it. Jason's the one that killed them. And DNA, the DNA matching thing. That's the only reason I'm here. Maybe I was the firefighter. Jason is part of a cult. Oh my god. It's an honor for us to have prepared this ritual for you. Will you do the honors? Oh man. Let's begin. Oh, God. Oh, I'm in control. Oh, God. This is dark. All right, let's get it done. Bye. Oh, no. Ah, oh, Jason. That's why he cut the symbol into my arm. So did he know? Oh, because he's part of the ritual. He's trying to put the blame on me so he can get out of here alive. Right, he understands. He already understands that cult and everything. But the truth should be etched into his skin. So you think, oh, the symbol is going to be somewhere on him already. Right, because he, uh... Right. Enter balcony. Dude, this just... This just got, like, a deep lore. With each sacrifice we gain, the fallen's life we obtain, growing stronger by the hour. And hell will wield unmatched power. <sighs> oh, dude. This looks cool. Oh. Alright. That's the visitor glide the guy who was on the phone sent me. Okay. I just need to make it to the visitor station. Okay, sure. Make it to the visitor station. Uh, can be ignited. Okay. Ignite. Ignite. Okay. Are these big memory things? Or is just this light to be cool? Alright, let's go over here. There's a person? No, it's like a... What is this? Like a control panel of sorts? What is this? Okay. There's a safe. Shh, okay. And there's doors locked. Emily and Chase. Exit route. Okay. Hold on. Interact. Look through binoculars. Yes. 
one equals eight. Okay, got it. Two equals seven. So we got one, eight. Wait. Eight, seven, nine. Did I get that right? Wait. Jason, what are we looking at? What are we looking at? Nine. Okay, so let me get this straight. Nine, seven, eight. So eight, seven, nine. Okay. Well, did I miss Jason? I didn't see him. Eight, seven, no, oh, nine. Unlock. Thank you. Key for this door right here. Door is locked. Yes, it is. Equip. Open door. Okay. Can't see Emily and Chase exit route. Three billion, twenty million, four hundred ninety thousand, two hundred and eighty-three. This should take me to the visitor station. Sure. Okay. Need to read. This is like cult. Like this is their headquarters, huh? The gate will open with a touch. When an inviter's handprint means so much. The gate will open with a touch when inviter's handprints mean so much. Okay. Okay. Hold on, let's go down this way. Oh, wheelchairs. They always are comforting. Use wheelchair. Why? Okay, let's leave this here for now. So I know what I'm doing. Maybe an idea of what to do with it. Open incinerator. There's someone humming inside. Ah, uh, okay. It's very difficult to control. Oh, you look around. Okay, I got it, I got it. Move Emily's real corpse. I like that it says real corpse. All right, let's take her. So her handprints? Maybe? Hold on, let me go see what's going on down here. Hold on, Emily. Give me a second. Oh. Oh, so this is going to be Chase. Okay, hold on. Place inviter. Great. Okay, let's go get Chase. This is... Yeah, this is quite the game. I am really enjoying this. The visuals, just everything about it is really good. Chase is real corpse. Let's get Chase on there. This is just normal behavior that people do. We just kind of move burn victims onto pedestals. Just kind of what we do. Not a big deal. He's breathing. Was she breathing like that? I don't like it. All right, Chase. Here we are. Enjoy. Awesome. <laughs> this is exactly where I want to be. Oh, actually, this is nicer. Answer the phone. Hmm. Did I answer? You know the truth, Lana. Jason. I do. Yeah. Only one of us is allowed to exit this place. Yeah, it's gonna be me. And the family will kill you before you make it to the visitor station. But don't worry, brother. We are grateful for your death. Oh, dude, this, this guy's a dick. Jason, I knew it from the get-go. Summoned together by mistake, only one can escape. One brother seeks the door to keep his dark lore. 
leaving the others to fate. Oh, the bars are crazy. Visitor station. We already made it to the visitor station, so he was wrong. Oh, nice, a mannequin. Verify your visitor identity. That's probably not good, is the DNA thing. So it, it knows. Okay. Moving on. It's a nice tunnel. Very full of life. And lots of things to look at. The atmosphere of this game is insane. I just want to, like, scream. I keep thinking, it's, is it getting darker or is it just me? Okay. We're good. They found you. Awesome. What? No? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. Are they there? I don't know. This is so tense. Oh, I can feel it gaining. Oh. Oh my god. My whole body. Oh, the chills. Steve says stop. Now, what have I told you to about trying to go outside of your afterday body? You don't understand. That guy over there, he's the reason why we're here. And what makes you say that? That symbol on his arm. The man who killed us had the same one. He's the one who killed us. <laughs> well, an individual who goes by the name William Turner has told me that he was the fireman who was trying to save you two. Wait, what? So that would mean that his mother is the one who killed you. He got a real tattoo on his arm. While this little tootsie roll just seems to have gotten a conveniently shaped scratch. <laughs> Thank you, Steve. <laughs> Damn. What's going on? Is William here too? Was this poor guy uh, trying to save us? Is his brother still here? Emily, I, you're a very sensible person. Thank you. Forget I ever said anything. No, you have to tell me more. Beep, I mean, Stop that. Beep, 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 I don't beep. know what you're talking about, but it looks like you two have passed outside of your aftergrave borders. And that means I have to send you back to your aftergrave. <gasps> tell him that we're... Oh my god, Steve is a hero. He was screaming at me at first, but Steve is a true hero. Location. Visitor station. Yep. And do I just keep following? Door open right there. Here we go. I have boarded the train. Alright. So, she now knows that my brother's a dickhead. And that I'm cool. I'm super sick. Hello. And Welcome hello, hi. On the visit to Glide. You are currently being transported to the aftergrave of your invited. Yes. You will arrive shortly. Yeah, that's fine. We'll just talk. I'll show her that like my arm thing is just a scratch, whereas my brother has a tattoo. A welcome gift has been sent from your inviter. The teleportation of your gift will commence in approximately three seconds. Is it a gun? The guns work here. Done. Right there. It is... A glass shard? Okay. What does that help me do? Glass shard covered in blood. Okay. Am I going to stab someone with this shard of glass? William rushed into the flames to save his family. Brave and bold, overcome by smoke, he fell, his story tragically told. Rescued by the fireman, he fought in the hospital's dim light, but lung damage claimed him. Turning day into endless night. <sighs> Donate blood, save life. Location. Aftergrave. This is a hospital, no? I've been here before. This is a hospital, right? This feels hospital-like. Interact. Call elevator, I guess. Okay. Go to patient floor. Yeah. That's where I would like to go. I need water. I need water. 
What's going on there? All right. Here we go. This is not a promising room. Are these poop stains? Poop stains? Oh no, it's an iron lung. Oh, thank God. You made it. Oh, thank God. I was worried they were gonna catch up to you in the hallway. What's up, William? You. Yes. Yeah. This is an odd situation to walk in on, Will. I can't lie to you. Why did you want me to come here? And who are you? You don't know you who he is. Me? You know who he is. I don't think so. Well then. Let me refresh your memory. Uh... William's eyes. Oh, this is gonna be when he runs in to, to uh, save his family. And then I pull him out. Rescue your family. Are we crawling? We're crawling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my. This is crazy. Is this Emily right here? The taller person, I feel like. I'm gonna get pulled out right before I get there, huh? Oh no, this is a... Oh no. It's Jason. <laughs> William Turner. Lung damage, right? Said lung damage. Saved by fireman. 1974 to 2013. Death in hospital from lung damage. Yeah. Oh my god. You. I don't know what to say. I wish I could have saved you and the rest of your family. And I tried so hard. You were the only one that I managed to retrieve from the fire. You would be alive if I had stopped you from running inside of that house. But what do you want to be, is another question. I'm so sorry, William. Don't say that. You did the best you could. And that's more than enough. William, thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, actually, he said thank you. This, our character was kind of like down on himself in the beginning, right? Because of this whole situation. So this will probably give him some some clarity and some 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 will to go on. Ask about his family. Why are you not with your family in this world? Died in different places. Honestly, I wish yeah. I died in that house fire because that would mean I would be with them right now. Oh man, I died in the hospital. That was enough for them to separate our aftergraves. And as every day goes by, it hurts even more to not be there with them. I miss them so much. I'm sorry, ma'am. This is a rough situation you're in, truly. Inspect CCTV system. Why do you have the surveillance system? True, why do you... This world is heavily surveilled so that the dead won't try to go outside of their active grave borders. There's only six. Usually the only ones that have access to the security system are the ones with authority in this world. But there's this guy in this world that you've probably met. The robot. Well, he... cares. Hmm. He gave me this system so I could watch over my family. And ever since the day I got this, I've been staring at the screen, waiting for the day my family would find and invite the person that they have been looking for. And then, you two came along. The invitation system only accepts one person at a time. But I guess you two mess up the system by being at the same place at the wrong Did time. Did he just blink? That's weird looking. And I instantly knew what was going on. I saw the symbol he cut into your flesh. He's framing me, William. William? Question mark? Why did you want me to come here? You know why. It's to kill your brother. Because... You're our only hope. Now. This world is like a threshold into the afterlife waiting area where we need to find peace with our demise oh. before we can cross over to the true afterlife, leaving our limbo state behind. Some do it by just letting time pass by, but in our case, time will never heal our wounds. 
If you avenge us, we can cross over into the true afterlife. I will be with my family again. Please. All right, William. Help right. us before it's too late. William, I've already agreed and to do help this. Come down. Before it's too late. William, I I know. It's fine. I'm going to do it. What do you mean before it's too late? Is there a time limit? Let me just show you. Your brother is on his way to leave this world through the visitor exit as we speak. How does he just the know? The portal only opens for one visitor per invitation. If he passes through, it will close. He said uh, only one of us can get out. That's what he said Your earlier. Your brother is trying to trap you here for all eternity. I mean, it's kind of chill. He's trying to kill you, so he's trying to get rid of you by giving you something worse than death. Spending an eternity alive. I can't talk to Steve about that. There's not like a customer service that'll help me get out. I can't, I don't have a representative that'll help me. Uh, I know what I need to do. I can't thank you enough. It's the glass shard. I need to stab him. I need to stab him right in his fucking eye. How do I make it to the, uh, the visitor robot. exit? Steve. Or should I say the human? Steve. His name's Steve. Have a look at the news article on my desk. Yep, yep. Receptionist dies in Colt Hotel Fire. Steve died to them as well. Oh! In a tragic accident, a hotel was set fire by a Colt, leaving behind a mysterious symbol on the wall. Thankfully, everyone managed to escape safely, ex except for the receptionist. Feels like the first person they would get out, to be honest. Steve Elliott. Steve Elliott ensured that all guests were evacuated, but sadly lost his life in the process. Steve's a better man than me. See, I said he's at the desk, he would be the first person to get out. He said, I'm gonna get everyone out. Saving us, but you'll be saving him as well. All right, William, all Tell right. Tell him everything you know, and he will definitely take you to the visitor exit. All right, all right, I got it, I got he it. You'll be free from his aftergrave. Okay. All right, mom. I got you, hold on. Let me ring the bell, ring a ding ding. Okay, I got it. I'll take care of it, don't worry. Ring the bell when you're ready, and you'll be teleported to the reception I'm hall. ready. And hey, don't look down on yourself because you couldn't save us back in the fire. Thank you, you're William. Saving all of us. Thank you, William. Very, I, I greatly appreciate that. Ring the bell. Steve, my man, what's going on, Steve? How you doing? How you living, Steve? You cool? Hello, hello, there, Steve. Hi. How can I help you today? Um, you died in a fire, Steve. I can help you, Steve. I can help you. I don't need any help. I don't need help, <laughs> but thanks for the offer. No problem, man. I know who you were, Steve. Just I didn't make any sense. Because I'm just a robot. No, Steve. You're not. Steve Elliot. He's in, like, spaz right now. I know who killed you. He's gonna spaz. Oh, no. Okay. He's just remembering. It was my brother, and he is on the way to the visitor exit. You need to take me there, so I can make things right. Yeah. Other eyes smile and are well, I won't be able to transport people to the grave. I'm getting in trouble if I transport you to the exit. Oh, you won't. You're going to be just fine. Because what I'm about to do will free you from your aftergrave. Okay, I will take you there. Thank you, Steve. Are you ready to go? I'm more than ready, Steve. Okay. Let's this song's go. gonna be copyrighted. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Steve, I'm glad I can help. By the way, Molly and Patty will kill each other. I'm gonna stab him in the head. 
Yeah, they stab him. <laughs> <laughs> it is, right, Steve? I'm actually gonna stab him in the eye, huh? Is this it? The boss fight? Is it or exit? Oh, that is a door. Chase Turner. Emily Turner. Jason locked the door behind him. Here's one of these things. Uh, anything else in here? No. Okay. Read note. Okay. I miss Dad. Dinner doesn't taste the same without him. He always made my favorite stuff, and it felt special. Like, it was just for me. The house feels weird and lonely, especially at night. I wish he was here to cook and play games with me. I miss him so much. Chase. August 17th. Grab the glass shard. Emily. Let's see what you have to say. I miss him so much. The silence in the house is unbearable. I ache for his touch, his voice, his presence. Nights are the worst, lying awake, wishing he was here to hold me. My heart feels so empty without him. Emily, August 11th. It takes a lot for a game to make me feel an emotion. And this is doing it. Just an, um, an emotion. All right, here we go. Uh, I don't know. Is it gonna do it for me? The order? It's a heart. Oh. Oh no. Enter visitor exit. Uh. All right. Wow. He's a superhero now, or a super villain. What's good, Jason? I'm here to kill you. No, you don't. Look at his arm. Peep the arm. The hell are you talking about? Oh, thanks, Jason. Oh, are you sure about that, Jason? Thanks, ma'am. No. No. I don't think so. I don't think burning people alive is ever the good thing. Ever. I don't think in history. All right, hold on. Uh, entry code 333 will enter the hatch for overclocking mode. You can only overclock one core at a time. If all three cores are overclocked simultaneously, the system will be overstimulated and the teleportation system will implode on itself. Use extreme caution. So we're not leaving. We're gonna make it blow up so he can't leave. Huh. Is that what's happening right now? Right? Hey! What do you think you're doing? Yeah. That's what's happening. Yeah. We're deciding that he can't leave. Or he, neither of us can leave. Goodbye, Jason. I need to avenge them. Ta-ta there, fuckboy. Kill Jason as he killed them. Avenge them. Oh! Oh my god. Probably really bright, but, uh, smile. Death registry. Jason Anderson. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, fuck boy. <laughs> 1989 to 2015. What? What is that? 26? Burned alive. Daniel Anderson. 
Could I die as well? 1987 to 2015. Lost his life to save them. <sighs> wow. I've always known my life might end protecting those who can't protect themselves. Oh my god. If it means they get to hold their loved ones a little longer, then my sacrifice is a small price to pay. This game is beautiful. Daniel Anderson, in their peace. Uh huh. I found mine too. Yeah, I knew that was as soon as he was having that conversation with William. He's getting some closure. He's moving on. He's dead, but dude, Jordan, that's a that's in it's amazing. That was an incredible game. Like. At no point was I bored, at no point did I find puzzles to be too difficult, which is ob it's a problem in a lot of horror games. You're just, this is great, dude. You better do this like for a living. This better be your job, because that's, this is great, man. This is really good. Um, outside sources, freesound.org. Uh, this person does not exist.com for old timey music. Is that gonna be copyrighted? I don't know, but dude, Dude, that was amazing. Oh, we got Hollow was the news anchor. Eight bit Ryan Swole, really? Huh? Nice. Okay. But yeah, that was amazing, dude. I can't, I can't say that enough. You just, you deserve so much credit, dude. That was amazing. And that's uh, ignited entry, guys. Until next time. Later. Support him.